Hey guys, I know it's been a long time. I haven't uh, uploaded a video in a while, um, but I am on vacation currently. Um, so this is kind of the only time I have uh, to do this, and I don't think I have that much room left on my phone. But yeah, um, I just wanted to show you some recent pickups while I've been on vacation. Let me move my phone here. But um, yeah, first the first day I got here, I'm in Destin, Florida, by the way. First day I got here, I went to uh, to Target. We did some grocery shopping for the family before you know we really got settled in and I went over there and then I saw this guy you know just sitting on the pegs by himself and he was uh, his package was kinda kinda beat up so I figured you know he'd be an opener so I opened him up and um, you know from the pictures I saw online um, I was kinda skeptical about picking this guy up but I really now that I did pick him up and opened him I really enjoy him he looks awesome and I can't wait to get him on a shelf you know um, He's just, um, like some of the people have been saying, you know, the paint apps on this guy is a little bit wonky. And it, now that I have it in my hands, you know, a physical copy of my own or whatever you want to say, um, I really enjoy it. He's a good looking figure, really. Um, I really like the uh, the welding marks on here. Um, I've got the, the, you know, the droid tick marks, the tally marks, whatever you want to call it. Um, he looks great. And like everybody's been saying, yeah, um, he does have two too small of a helmet in my opinion but that's the only thing that I think is kind of lacking in this figure but um you know everything's there this the only thing I you know wish this had was the uh, ball jointed hips here and then the cloth came uh, and then the the joint inside the uh, what do you call it the abdomen whatever um, but besides that this figure is great everything's there um, the accessories those blasted pistols you get they're awesome and um, before I went on vacation, I think like a two two nights before we went on vacation, my dad picked this up for me. So here they are standing together. He's quite a bit shorter. I didn't realize that, but yeah, wow. Um, yeah, there we go. Wolf and Rex here. Uh, um, Wolf is substantially shorter, almost like it's way shorter. But um, I love Wolf. Wolf is awesome. These both of these figures, you can't go wrong. Um, I haven't been able to find them anywhere else. They're both awesome figures. <clears throat> um, I love the fact that Wolf has the ball jointed hips and the cloth came uh, and the same blaster pistols you get with Rex. Um, he's got the uh, the crunch here you can do. Everything else is fully articulated, like super articulated. And um, both of these figures are great. Um, they look great on a shelf. So yeah, I brought these with me. I brought Wolf with me in hopes of taking some photography in the sand because you know this is the based off of the desert um the desert suit that he had wolf in the clone wars so yeah i was hoping to do something like that so yeah that's pretty much it for these two figures and then i've got of course you see in the background um i found a cody kind of yeah i found a cody um he looks amazing my face looks weird in this reflection but yeah he looks awesome um I went into a Walgreens here in Destin, and uh, there were two of them. I got one, and my cousin, he's uh, he's been into collecting for a while, too, and he picked up the other one. But, yeah, he just looks super cool. Awesome figure. Like, I just, so, like, so surprised that I found him there. I'm still looking for IG-88, so, yeah, I'm ready to find him as well. But, yeah, this Cody is wicked, wicked. And I finally found my own Bosk. I've been waiting to find him as well. My dad has has one, yeah, and I compete with my dad sometimes, but yeah, my dad's got one, and now I have one. I'm super glad, and um, another thing I've been noticing about this recent wave is, you know, some, like Bosk, doesn't have this, but some do. <clears throat> the multilingual card, and this is what you see, this kind of thing, is what you'd see in Europe, like European cards. So, I don't know what it is, but I think stuff like this right here is good stuff to hold on to and not open and keep because in my opinion I think what they're doing Hasbro is um getting these waves out as quick as possible because they're really rushed out if you, if you notice that um, they're being rushed out and not a whole lot of people are finding this stuff and I think uh, what they had you know left of maybe the European stock they just started sending it out and um, I think the reason why they're starting to send this out so quickly is they're preparing for the Force Awakens stuff that's coming out in September on Force Friday. So um, 
yeah, this is just something that you guys, if you see, just pick it up because I think, I have a feeling these are going to get hiked up in price and these are going to be really hard to find. So yeah, that's my video for you guys. I just wanted to kind of do a little short short review, I guess you could say, and then kind of a haulage video. So uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'm sorry again that it's been so so long, but yeah, I don't, don't think I've forgotten about you guys. But uh, thank you, and may the force be with you guys.